Hey there, this is Shweta. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about how you can use the screen recording feature on Canva to either pre-record a webinar, workshop or masterclass or record it live and share the link with your audience. So if that is something you're interested in, you're in the right place. Also, if you're new here on this channel, we talk all about marketing tips and strategies to help you start and grow your online business. So if that is something you're interested in, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so we're inside of Canva right now. The first step that we're going to do is create a presentation. So I'm going to click on create a design and I'm going to look for presentation. And then I'm going to open this and here is where you are going to go ahead and design your presentation. So either you already have a design that you want to use or you want to create a new one. You can use all the amazing templates that Canva provides here. Uh, you can search for a template that you would need. Let's say you're creating a presentation on mar marketing. You can look for marketing here and you'll get all of these templates. So let's say this is the presentation that we're doing. I'm going to select the template and click on apply all. So you can see now my presentation has all of these pages and here you can see all the different, I'm just going to close this. So here you can see all the different slides that are available. And of course you want to make sure you're editing the slides according to your brand colors and fonts. So let's say you wanted to edit a particular slide, you could just click on it and then edit it accordingly. So now that your presentation is ready, there are two ways you can share your screen using Canva. So there are two features. The first one is present and record. So if you are pre-recording a presentation where you want to record your screen, you would use the present and record feature. When you click on present, you have this option of present and record. That's what you will use. The other option is to run a live uh, webinar or workshop of sorts right inside of Canva. So you could share a link with your audience and they could attend the webinar or workshop live where you're sharing your screen but using the Canva platform. So if you want to do that, you would just use uh, either present a view or standard and you would use the Canva live option. So first let's look at the present and record option. So let's say you want to record this as a pre-recorded training. I'll click on present and record and I'll click on next and we will click on go to recording studio. So here you can see um, now it's going to ask you to set up your camera and microphone. Uh, so here is my camera. You can choose whichever camera you want to use or if you don't want to record yourself, you just want to record the screen, you can say no camera. And then here is uh, the audio. So you can choose what audio option to go with. And then you can just hit start recording. So this is the screen that is being recorded and you have all your different slides here and you can just go to the next one by clicking here or directly go to uh, a different slide from uh, this dashboard uh, that's at the bottom. Before you start your recording, you could also add notes that you want to make sure you remember while you're presenting. And again, these notes are going to be visible only to you because this is the only recording screen, the, the red outline that's here. So these notes are not going to be visible to anyone. So you can go ahead and uh, record. Once you're done with the recording, you can just click on end recording. You also have the option to pause the recording and resume it again. If you missed out something or if you want to go back or if you want to look through your notes, you could just pause. Once you're done, you can just end the recording and Canva is going to upload your recording to your Canva account. You also have this link to the recording uh, that you can share with someone. So when they go to this link, let's say they go to this link, uh, it will open up the recording for, for them. So this is a great way if you're selling a pre-recorded paid workshop or webinar, this is a great way to just use Canva to record your presentation and share the link with your audience. 
you can also directly download the recording here i would generally you know just use the link because it's just so easy you don't need to download it and then upload it to google drive or some other platform like vimeo you could just directly share this link with your audience and then you can also save and exit so your recording is also saved in your canva account so that was the first option works well if you are using a pre-recorded workshop or webinar the second option is uh, basically if you want to do a live using canva again most people don't know this but you don't really need a webinar or a workshop platform if you're if you want to run like a live webinar or workshop or masterclass you could do that with canva itself so let's look at that option so to uh, start your canva live again you'll go to present uh, let's go to standard and this option here is canva live so i'm just going to click on that and here you know if you want to read more about canva live you can click on this uh, link here i'm just going to click on start new session and here it says let your audience join from any device so i'm going to start the session and this is the invitation and this is the invitation. So you can copy this invitation and share with your audience, or you can also tell them to go to canva.live and enter this code to kind of watch this presentation live. And then if you don't want to hide this, you can just hit hide. And you know, this is how your pre presentation is going to be. You can also like, you know, do it like a presentation mode where it's going to play by itself. I don't want to do this. I'll just hit on next page to move to the next page if I wanted to. Uh, if you wanted to open present of you, you could do that here. This is basically going to be the screen that your audience sees. So I'm just going to close this for now. When you click on magic sh shortcuts, you can adjust the timer or add a timer. You can add blur or make your screen blur you can uh this is a fun feature to ask people to just like be quiet or something uh bubbles confetti so if you were sharing like a giveaway winner the conf confetti is great drum roll and then you have like all of these options that you could use as part of your presentation and then of course you when you do this you come back to your canva slides but the canva live is still on so if you see this icon here that means your canva live is still on let's go back to the canva live okay so this is how you can uh you know like use canva to run a webinar or a presentation or pre-record one and share it with your audience why whether it's free or paid this is a great option i'm just going to end this and now you see the canva live has ended you can click here to start a new session uh i'm just going to click out but um like you saw you can create your presentation right inside of canva presented live or recorded while sharing your screen uh, with your audience and then share the link to the recorded video or share the link to the live session so that you don't have to use any other platform to share your free or paid webinar workshop or masterclass with your audience i hope this video was helpful for you if you find this helpful don't forget to share it and hit that like button and also subscribe to this channel for more such videos on marketing tutorials and tips to grow your online business. Thank you for being here and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.